a soul portrait is rooted in a self-portrait. It's really very much about the practice of uh, learning anatomy, learning technique, learning you know how to paint eyes and lips and nostrils and hair. It's, um, it's very much also because it's a self-portrait, it's about looking in the mirror and through looking in the mirror, especially over a week or two weeks, in that process there is a lot of opportunity for self-acceptance and self-love forgiveness of our ancestors seems to come up with looking into our eyes and seeing our mothers or our fathers or our grandparents. So there's an incredibly deep opportunity that's available in the self-portrait. But then we also try to balance that technical exploration and, um, and more left brain tools with getting out of the way and trusting the process and paying attention to our dreams and paying attention to little feelings that come through us as we're painting. The soul portrait really becomes a lot about the in-breath and the out-breath, the balance of the masculine and the feminine and the left brain and the right brain. And, and it's, it's both showing up and being diligent and learning these tools and paying attention and it's surrendering and allowing and being open to surprises and the mystery of the painting process because there is nothing more strange and delightful and inspiring and bewildering than smearing colorful mud on a piece of canvas. There is an opportunity there for both trivial delights and profound transformations. Teaching has come really naturally to me, I feel. Um, not that I ever set out thinking that I would be a teacher or that I actually knew anything. Um, when the moments occur that I have some piece of information to offer to someone or I have asked a question and I have the opportunity to give someone a key to their own creative process, uh, that's when I really realized that maybe this has always been a big part of my journey, a big part of my creative journey, and it's taught me so much, and so it's really this incredible feedback loop that's just growing and growing, and the more I learn, the more I can teach, and the more I teach, the more I can learn, and it's just, uh, it's an amazing spiral to watch in its expansion, and so it's been sort of accumulating over the years, and um, for the more recent uh, last six years, I've been doing this Soul Portraits journey, going to different countries around the world and hosting a week to ten day retreat um, with yoga and delicious food uh, through Bella Retreats. you wholeheartedly um, to give yourself the gift of time and spaciousness to step away from the busy world and come into this retreat to let it fall away just long enough for you to show up to a blank canvas and see what comes of it. There's a uh, a beautiful opportunity there and it is my utmost honor and delight to paint with you and to guide you and support you and do my best to empower you to find that deep teacher within you 
and to find the joy in your creative spirit that comes through this incredible process of making art.